everyone, Nat Frankenstein here and today we will be unboxing November's horror block. So if you're interested, please keep watching. You guys, horror block, here we go. Horror block for November. Let's unbox it. So uh, first up, there is the t-shirt. My hair is being very emo today. Um, we have a t-shirt. And it is a Hannibal t-shirt. So uh, for this month, Hannibal was the featured brand in the horror box. So Hannibal t-shirt. I'm not actually into Hannibal, so I will probably get rid of that one, unfortunately. Next, and this is one thing I do love, it is a Hannibal heart-shaped stress ball. And you can always use a stress ball, well, a stress heart in this instance. The next thing we got, or I got, um, I was really excited about, I love them. They are the Scalers by NECA. I have little Godzilla. He is so cute, look at him. Um, and the great thing about them is they, um, they hang on to your, like, earbuds or any kind of, uh, computer cables, electronics cords, lanyards, video game cables, microphone cords, shoelaces, pull cords. So anything cord-like, they will fit on. The next item we got, and this is really cool, this item, it is a film cell from uh, A Nightmare on Elm Street. Um, it also comes with a certificate of authenticity, which I'm assuming is inside. I don't know if you can see the cell. I'm sorry about the glare, but that is it. So that's kind of cool. I'm a huge Nightmare on Elm Street fan, so that is awesome. Next we get a DVD, and it is Towels from the Crypt Keeper. Myth Conceptions, and it is the cartoon uh, based on Tales from the Crypt, which I adored. Um, I love the Crypt Keeper. Um, this one has eight episodes on it, and um, I'm, I'm really looking forward to watching this. Next, we have a hanging car sign, and it says Cthulhu on board, and this is so awesome. It is actually going to go in my car. Um, Usually, I don't like people who hang, you know, like, baby on board stickers or, um, you know, have, like, the stick family stickers on the back of their car. I just think it's so lame. But this, I love Cthulhu and this is really cute. Next we have stickers. Again, they're Hannibal stickers. Um, Hannibal features very strongly in this uh, horror block, uh, blah, 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 in this horror block. I don't know. Maybe I'll have a giveaway if you like Hannibal stickers. I don't know. I'll think of something to do with them. I'm not going to use them. Um, I don't know. I tried watching it, but I just I couldn't. I couldn't get into it. So, which is a shame because I, I really enjoy the Silence of the Lamb movie. Or like, you know, the Hannibal um, movie series. But, oh well. I will figure out something to do with these for sure. Uh, there's also, um, just, you know, like a little pamphlet, not pamphlet, little card about the Hannibal DVDs, um, which are available now. Free plug. And lastly, of course, we have an issue of Angoria. Um, I just realized that I'm fairly sure we were getting... Were we getting Rue Morgue magazines before we were getting Fangoria ones in the horror block? I feel like it's just been like a big switch of Rue and it's caught me off guard. I'm going to have to double check. However, uh, we have Fangoria. We also have the beautiful Norman Reedus on the cover. Um, Walking Dead fans will love this, I'm sure. Let's have a look. It says Norman Reedus, actor, artist, icon. So, he's pretty cool. And he follows me on Twitter, which is also cool. So there we have it, you guys. That is November's horror block. I realized that it is mid-December and I'm doing this review 
but we don't get the horror blocks until like the first or second week of December anyway so um you know my bad <laughs> but there's nothing I can really do about it but um um you know it wasn't a bad block I think you know I, there was a lot of Hannibal merchandise in it again like the stress the stress heart I don't mind but I think it was a bit of a gamble perhaps um you know including so many Hannibal-esque merchandises that doesn't make any sense but you know what I mean I think having so many Hannibal products in there may kind of you know it's not going to suit everyone but other than that it was a really great block horror block is continually getting better and better um i think out of the you know horror block nerd block loot crate there's booty bin um i think horror block is a real contender so i will leave information down below if you're interested in getting a horror block which you totally should if you're a horror fan that's this month's well last month's um unboxing and if you like this i'll beat my crazy inability to say words which is wiggity whack if you like this video please don't forget to rate comment subscribe i would love to talk to all you horror fans out there let me know what you think about the horror block if you got a horror block or if you get any other subscription boxes let me know which ones talk to me about them let me know what you think which one's better and um yeah until next time i'm maddie frankenstein and i will see you later